Mara Brockakil is a visionary storyteller who has always worked to fuel us, painting our portraits through words, centering our humanity on screen, and amplifying our untold stories. Mara Brockakil is also a singer, not a good one. <laughs> I say this not to embarrass her because she's incapable of being embarrassed, <laughs> but because it's. <laughs> but because it, it's what makes her so special as an artist. We met in the writer's room of South Central. I'm hella shy, Mara is not. We clicked as friends immediately. She yanked me out of my shell, pushed me to the dark side. We worked on the Fox lot and she taught me how to hotwire the electric carts with the Brad. Or maybe I taught her, but you absolutely encouraged me. And as we zipped down the alleys and ran through stop signs, evading the popo, <laughs> we used to sing two songs at the top of our lungs, Queen Latifah's Superstar and Alanis Morissette's Ironic. Now I'm a person to whom karaoke is absolutely my kryptonite. It is literally my waking nightmare. But Mara inspired me to let go. She is fearless. She embraces joy. She lives in the moment. She is fuck it personified. And she sings at the top of her lungs. Key be damned. <laughs> All of these incredible things she infuses in her work. She creates characters that inspire us and that we aspire to be. That doesn't mean that they are without flaws. Perfection is unattainable. Her characters stumble, they fall, they get back up. They lose and find themselves. They grow, they change, they evolve. They break hearts and get their hearts broken. They forgive and accept forgiveness, and they sing off key. They are real and tangible, and they inspire all of us to let go. I'm so proud to call you Marmar, one of my dearest friends. And maybe when she comes up here, you guys can encourage her to do a little Latifah. <laughs> but first, here's a reminder of her work and her journey.